two people and injured one other. It's like a nightmare that I just can't... It's like a nightmare that I just can't wake up from. says it will permanently disconnect all one-inch gas lines from its three thousand attached to an abandoned well. Mark Martinez and his brother-in-law, Joey Irwin, were killed. Neighbors on Twilight Avenue. On April 17th, 2017, my home exploded because odorless natural gas had saturated the soils and invaded the drains into my On April 17th, 2017, soils and invaded the drains into my house, escaping from a nearby oil and gas well. I just don't know how to get through it. I've been well for about a year, was turned back on. My husband Mark and brother Joey were working in the basement at the time, and they did not survive the explosion. There have been several stories blaming the explosion on a hot water heater installation. These stories could not be further from the truth. Nothing they did caused the explosion. My home and family were destroyed because my house was next to a leaking flow line that had been left connected to the well. It is public knowledge that the well was owned by Anadarko. Trapped between falling debris. My son had to crawl on his knees through a tunnel to a window and make the decision to jump out and save, save his own life. A group of heroic construction workers nearby saw him jump out and quickly worked to save And that a tragedy like this will never happen again. But as Colorado keeps growing... Can I look at her phone if still up yeah. there? Yeah, yeah, okay. But the statutory fees be paid the, and court costs, the court's going to grant the prosecution. However, the explosion happened because gas from an abandoned and severed pipeline oh, explodes and goes up in flames. You could see the smoke from miles away. The home is on twilight. Oh my God. The flames raging. The house collapsed. You know. A neighbor captured this dramatic video moments after hearing an explosion. This picture shows more aftermath. A house leveled reduced to a pile. I turned down our street and the whole entire house was... I turned down our street and the whole entire house... Uh, our luggage did not make it. I turned down our street and the whole entire house... Uh, our luggage did not make it. I turned down our street and the smoke, whole... smoke, you know, visibility. Video from Air Tracker 7 shows thick smoke pouring from Firestone tonight that recreation district will present Martinez's jury Jersey rather to his family in Colorado Mark Martinez and Joey Irwin died in 2017 a leaking gas flow line led to the extra fine against energy company Kerr McGee the biggest penalty ever leveled in our state we've detailed the proposed projects to be funded with the settlement money at cbsdenver.com we're learning more about the specific They get all of us thinking about how to be safer inside our homes. Today, families in Weld County will have another way to monitor gas leaks. So the county has... community is warrior strong tonight. It's been very devastating. Once stood. 
can't believe it. The explosion leveled the house. Family members tell us Mark Martin. Some of the nicest people you will ever, ever meet. Ever. They towed this charge. Master Plumber. Everybody loved him. Now, we first learned this from a well-placed source early in the day, but in calling several other sources close to the investigation, nobody wanted to touch this. Wait. Now, sources tell us that the oil tanks were mostly full. And it's clear this story has not been. It's a feeling that's echoed across this. But what Trippy says the community needs right now is one of Even that was too late. It was, it's still tough. It's still tough. Corby Bracken is the head of health and safety. You know, something I think folks in our office. I work at Andarco Petroleum Corporation. I'm contracted to Andarco Petroleum Corporation. Okay, and you work out of an office setting where? I do healthy, health, safe, and and environment. Okay, so Super you work high. in the office. And... After what happened. To inspect other oil and gas sites. Within an hour, the house was reduced to ashes, water, and something even more meaningful. We have a team. Moving underground. If they find any evidence from the well.